evening, ladies as well as gentlemen, Papa Boris here, playing some more Civ 6. So in the last uh, video, we spent 35 minutes gearing up to take over the uh, Japanese capital. I think I'm done making units. I have so much gold that I'll just rush by some if it turns out I need them. In the meantime, I think, um, let's get some, let's get some, uh, who do I want? The Great Merchant Points or the Great Engineer Points? Grants an oil, trade routes, two gold. That's pretty good. This district's regional buildings provide plus two production. This district's... Didn't I get... Oh, no, I was looking at it and thinking of how cool that would be. But I didn't actually get him yet. All right, but I'm going to get him. So let's go ahead and go for the great merchant points at the commercial hub investments. I really wish there was a way to queue things up to just keep on doing this thing. But that's what I'll do with all the cities that don't have anything that I can build productively anymore. All right, my scout is just going to wander on in here and see if there's a way back way into Cairo. And the answer is yes, but it's going to be so annoying to get through here. Like, it's just going to be a pain in the ass to, like, get a bombard in. I had no idea that there were all these mountains. It might even be better just, like, to backdoor my way into Aleppo, but there's this beautifully placed encampment here making that annoying. So, yeah, we're going to, I think, just do the forward approach uh, for Cairo through Rio de Janeiro, which is a little bit more annoying than it could be, but it's not the end of the world either. All right, uh, I don't want to actually move him. I want to fortify him. And you, I'm just going to skip. All right, so I guess I can spare one crossbowman to find out what the hell's going on. This encampment, it's just a regular old spearman. It's not even a big deal. All right, you're fine where you are. Knight. Um, okay, so I already have two knights swimming over. I guess we can try a multi-pronged approach here. So in addition to the knight swimming over, I'll need to have a bombard and like a field cannon. So where will I put... I actually don't know where I'm going to put the bombard yet because I can't quite see. Maybe this space will be able to hold it because this looks somewhat flat. There's a marsh there. I can't quite tell what that is. Yeah, this, actually, this is all one more, so I don't know what these two hexes are. So I might be able to stick a bombard there and, like, have the knights ride through. So we'll try it. All right, you. Is there any more luxuries to hook up? Uh, do, 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 do. I think that is pretty close to all of them, if it isn't all of them already. I'm not even sure it matters very much. This is outside of my reach. Okay, so I don't think anything matters anymore. We will just, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna figure out which city is at the housing capacity and like go there and just like build farms. So 10 out of 14, 7 out of 12, 15 out of 17, 13 out of 13. All right, this is the place then, Berlin. So we're gonna go down here and just, um, you know, look for like places where I can build a stupid farm. So we got three knights sailing across. And uh, my musket... Chasing the chariot is a stupid idea, so we'll just take the promotion here. And you know what? I got I got gold. I'm going to rush by... Purchase? I'm going to rush by a bombard here for... Jesus, these are expensive. Um, I'm making 200 gold a turn. F it. Let's do it. Let's, let's just get one. And we'll send this across the, the ocean as well. Alright, you... Slowly, slowly, slowly making your way over to where you can shoot at Kyoto. Let's fortify the knight for the time being. That guy actually needs to make way for the bombard. So we'll send him over there. You can fortify, it's fine. Oh, who needs orders? Always somebody needs orders. Alright, knight, I guess we can send you over to Rio de Janeiro because we got enough for Kyoto. Crossbowman. Alright, this is the guy I sent over to get promoted up here when the time comes. Brazil got a lot of those things, but no, we're fine. Only one out of four converted. No one's winning the religious victory yet. All right, here we're just going to make a uh, commercial hub investment. Just get tons of gold and um, do those, those points for great people. And here are plus one amenities still, doing all right. Actually, can I make an aqueduct? I don't need to, because I am not really growing in that place. Okay, commercial hub investment. There we go. 
Cross Bowman is... I guess I can move him a little bit more to a forward position. And I got a Bombard. Alright. I probably don't need actually two of them. But so be it. Napoleon. Uh, he does not help Bombards. He is... Yeah. Industrial and modern. So I'm waiting. I'm just waiting to turn that into a crossbow or into a field cannon and then upgrade it to an army. So we're fine. Okay. The time has come. Oh, wait. The bombard can't move and shoot at the same time. So, because it's, cause it's artillery. Wait. Oh, you know what I can do? Hang on. Hang on. I'm actually going to just. Why not have both of these shoot at Kyoto? It's, it's actually so flat here. I can sh have two of them shooting from three away, which is really unusual, actually. It's not often you get to pull that off. Alright, this actually wasn't too bad. I've had cases where I get, like, get a bunch of barbarian musket men and stuff coming at me, and this wasn't nearly that bad. So we will just um, pick it up in a couple of turns with that crossbow. You, you're a little far back. Get a bit closer, maybe? So you're ready to go to Brazil. Musket man. I don't know. I don't want this musket set this going across the water. It's just, it's just too slow. Oh, hey, my walls are actually being rebuilt here. Interesting. Um, let's just get back into the city and call it a day. Sail away. Sail away. And can you keep sailing? Yep. And you need to start sailing. Oh, I, I guess I just bought that thing this turn, so never mind. Oh, God. All right, so the horses keep being a nuisance. That's fine. All right. So now what we do is we step forward with a knight so we can see the capital. Now this allows the bombard to shoot three spate. Okay, what am I missing here? Don't these things have a range of three? Okay, oh god, rules. What am I what am I missing here? Let me just take a quick look at the civilopedia. Ah, uh, bombard. Oh, it has a range of two. Um, I don't know why I thought Bombard's had a range of... You know what? You know what it is? I think this must have been changed in a patch. There's no way that I could have, like, upgraded... Because if you upgrade them all the way to four, you get a plus one range boost. There's no way that I could have done that, like, upgraded one four times and thought that then three was the base. So, yeah, they only have a range of two. That's mega lame. Oh, shit. That's super terrible. Uh, they're just not even worth building because they, while they do shred up cities very well... Um, they don't do a better enough job compared to field cannons against walls that you don't just want to like wait an extra turn for your uh, field cannons, you know, an, an extra ten, turn, 10 turns for your field cannons to finish researching. Yeah, okay, so they don't have a range of three, they have a range of two, that's just abysmally bad. Um, I guess we'll just have the knights do some horse slaying. I don't care about the scouts, the scouts are not hurting me at all here. But I need to step forward, I guess, with the bombard. Um, so that I'm actually able to shoot. This bombard is going to get hit by the encampment. Hopefully I can take over the city pretty quickly, though, and it won't be such a big deal. Let's actually, um, can I just kill this scout? Yeah, let's see if we can tempt the encampment into firing at the knight instead of firing at my bombard. Alright, let's keep going here with the commercial hub investment. I have to keep doing that every two turns. wish there was a way to queue things up, maybe in a later patch. And you can actually make a factory, so sure, we'll do that. All right, the scouts here. Well, now that I know the bombards have a range of only two, uh, I don't think I'm going to be squeezing in through the back door here. Well, maybe. Let's take a quick look here. Cairo's there. I'd have to, like, snake my bombard into there, and then I could shoot at the capital. Of course, there's an encampment right here. Oh, that's awful. Oh, and they also made a... Well, the city, I have to kind of get through that, don't I? Oh, they made a new city, too. Jesus, there's a lot of cities here. No, what I'd have to do is kind of suck it up, and take over Aleppo with, what, three knights and a bombard? That's possible, actually. So I just arrive on shore. I, like, stick a knight there, stick a knight there, stick the bombard here, and just shoot at this encampment and take it down. And then, um... And, uh, yeah, and then, and then maybe I can get the capital that, to Cairo that way. So that's, like, my secret special mission that's going to be doing that while I'm trying to get Rio de Janeiro and, uh... Can this bombard move yet? Thank you. Um, while yeah, while my while, while the rest of my army is just trying to get like 
Kyoto and Rio de Janeiro. We'll see if I can like squeeze out a slightly faster win by having this backdoor approach. All right, you're fine where you are, and you're fine where you are. You need to fortify. Please tell me that was everything. All right, so Japan's shooting at me. Not too surprised. That's a pretty sensible thing to... Oh, God. A unit formed there. Okay. So we're going to one-shot the scout. Luckily, it was just a scout. So my bard got a little bit damaged. But now, you'll see <laughs> that was some pretty significant damage done to the city center. It's just a single shot. So it's, it's definitely worth it to get those. Um, I can actually plunder a trade route. Yeah, we're going to do it. Even though it takes up my whole turn. It's whatever. Um, and then, can I actually stop the city from healing? Yes, actually. So if I... Right over here... Tragically, I can't pillage. And then I take this knight and I put him here. Everything, sh everything is within my zone of control. The river's not blocking any key spaces, so I should be fine. You just finished making your commercial investment. So we'll do that again. You have finished everything you can... That I could possibly care about. Oh, uh, sure. We'll, we'll finish a crossbowman, I guess, if it's just one turn. And you're at zero amenities. Do I care about this? Oh, the heavy chariot rode over here. Interesting. Can I finish it off? Yes, I can. <laughs> With my club wielding warrior. Okay. That's fine. Let's get a commercial hub investment going there. And you, I'm just going to hit the E button and hope he finds stuff to do. Because I don't really care anymore. The knight, I'm just going to fortify him. I'm not, I'm not going to forget about him there. Yeah, we'll just fortify those up. Napoleon's still waiting. One more turn. Crossbowmen got healed up. Uh, let's get you back in friendly territory so that you can be ready to be promoted. And same with you. Bombard sailing across the seas. Got some green berets over here. Doing some heavy shit. Fucking Cairo in the ass. Well, hopefully. Okay, we're gonna put the bombard on the hill there. And that's gonna make Brazil angry, but I don't care. I'm just gonna ignore him when he gets pissy about me for having units on his border. Of course, uh, these forests are not gonna be good enough now, I, I know. I'm gonna have to step one step further with each of those bombards before I can actually fire. I'm just gonna make it <clears throat> a little bit trickier than it should be. Does Joan of Arc actually help? with the bombards it is renaissance oh she does she should actually come over here to help she should have been over here to help the this this entire time but uh since she wasn't i guess better late than never okay i actually finished ballistics finally so i can make my bombards into artilleries for even more damage i feel like it's the most relevant thing we're just gonna go ahead and do it um i got a great person i bet it's a merchant yes cool and you can just go ahead and poppity doppity dingle there. All right, so commercial hub investments. Commercial hub investments. Other oh, taking two turns. I wish they. I actually wish I could just have them going for more turns. Oh, hey, I can actually make stuff. I can make a make a great lighthouse. Plus one movement for all naval units. And oh, I have to lose my. No, I'm not losing my crabs. I'm gonna make a colossus. Yeah, timely, very timely Colossus arrival here. All right, so the crossbowmen, let's go ahead and start upgrading. I saved up a big old honking hoard of gold so we can upgrade all these bitches. Now, this Napoleon dude, just go ahead and make a an army. So this guy has a strength of 77 ranged and 67 melee versus a regular field cannon, which is 50 and 60. So that's definitely it's, it's 17 extra strength. It's a huge-ass deal. And we're going to send him over to the military front. We're ready to ready to go. Okay, these bombards taking some hits. The thing about the bombards that does kind of suck is that they do amazing damage to the city walls, but the actual defenses are, are less impressive uh, as far as damage goes. All right. My knights are getting beat up pretty bad here. But I might actually be able to get this. Nope, didn't quite get it. Alright, some of my knights might die. It's a possibility. There's a traitor here? Weird. Uh, okay, let's do 3 to 7, I guess. And then the crossbow can take out this camp. I need to get him back for upgrades. There's a traitor there. Um, I don't know why I'm having to reselect all these routes. But uh, put you back in Frankfurt. Traitors, good lord. 
I guess I, I guess all these trade routes just need to be reset for some strange reason. All right, sail away, sail away, sail away. Luckily, there's no barbarians here causing any havoc. That would have been annoying. All right, upgrade you, upgrade you, upgrade you. Moved you, can't upgrade you yet. All right, I can't, I would love to peace out with him, but I need to take over the capital first. So I just, that's, that's the problem. I would have loved to take peace there. Um, but I, I really need to get the capital first because otherwise I'm not actually getting any progress towards the, uh, the victory. Hang on, let me take a quick look at great people. Oh, I'm already well on my way to my next great merchant. Plus one level of, what the shit is this shit? Oh, fuck this fucking ball sack. All right, I guess let's just get Nikola Tesla then with these industrial zone logistics. Um, all right, hopefully I don't die. It would, you know what, God, it would, you know what, hang on. I don't, I don't need this. I don't need this. Let's get bonus strength when defending. I do not want that thing to die. I don't need the damage. I can just take out the city with my knights. So let's just do this. Get the capital. Oh, I can, I can, this, there's been some, you know, there's been some stealth changes here. It used to be that when you took over a city, you could, you did not get the opportunity to shoot out of it. Um, so that's kind of interesting that you can now. Oh, synagogue, how cute. Um, all right. Now I'm going to see if he'll peace out with me. Can you give me some stuff? Well, you obviously need to seed me Kyoto. Uh, how about the Philosopher's Stone and the Prince and Discourses on Livy? Would you want to give me some gold? And how about these oranges? All right, you're giving me everything. Sounds good. All right, so we got one of the capitals. That's lovely. All right, let's see if we can get Rio de Janeiro in the next 20 minutes. That would be ideal, of course. So what's going to happen now is we're just going to... Oh, okay. Actually, I think I need to declare war. No, let's let's get this other bombard a little bit closer. There's no need to rush things. I can't see his defenses, but I know they're in there. So it's one of those things where you, you want to be a little bit cautious just so that things go as smoothly as possible. All right. Um, you need to get... Actually, let's take a step forward and then upgrade. Might as well save some time. All right. You guys just need to get a freaking move on. Buenos Aires is my ally, so I can actually move through this. The problem is it doesn't actually help me. No, you know what? It does. It does help me. I can take Brasilia and maybe have a slightly more direct route to Cairo. So that's what we're going to do. We're going we're gonna to get to the edge of Brasilia there with these field cannons and just use them. It's a bit too late to turn this bombard around, I think, so we'll just have both bombards there. Crossbow man. All right, you're going to go into the city and upgrade to a field cannon. I think for the knights, we'll just move as far as they can move in a turn and then promote. So let's get the let's get the defense bonus. I don't know if that works against city attacks or not, but we'll see. I guess this guy will just max out his ability to con conquer the city. Field cannons, get a move on. And that warrior, I'm not going to upgrade him to a musket man because I just don't care. Uh-oh. Spaghettios, this is bad. So now these barbarians are gonna start hounding me, and the bombard, in a way, is like the most important unit. Uh oh, shoot. So the knights are gonna make it safe and sound. Um, they're gonna miss the the mark a little bit though, but that's fine. Uh, mainly I now am concerned about the bombard. I think the barbarians will be able to just keep going and harassing him. Field cannon army, great. All right, let's um. You know what? Let's send the field cannon army over here. Then it can push right away towards Cairo. All right, there's a farm there. I'm most concerned about what's happening with this bombard. Yeah, this is what I'm concerned about. It's getting hit pretty hard. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to sacrifice one of these knights. I'm hoping that the barbarians go after the knight instead of after the bombard so I can get the bombard onto the shore and heal. Alright, what's happening here? Oh yeah, let's go for industrial zone logistics. I wish I knew if there was like a hotkey for that. Alright, at least like at least like there's like a scroll bar here I didn't even know was there. That's cool. Alright, uh nothing to build there. 
Oh god, they all happen at the same time. Oh, this is Japan. All right, let's repair your stuff. And is it time to declare war on Brazil? I feel like it's got to be. So we're going to move the knights to the border, at least as much as possible. And Joan of Arc will come over, join one of the knights. Even though she doesn't actually help the knights, she only helps the bombards. Okay. I think we're going to do this. Can I declare a formal war? Oh, yes. Oh, Pedro, you have such a great personality. If only personality counted for something. Okay, that bombard can't move. These, this knight actually doesn't have enough movement points to move in. <laughs> that, was, that was good movement. Good job. Good job. Okay. Uh, the bombard can't move, unfortunately, but next turn. You can't move in, so next turn. And the failed cannons, that's just march them in there. I wish I had sent a trade route over at some point. You know, it actually would have been handy to have a trade route sent over to Rio de Janeiro just like the one time. So that uh, I could like travel across a road to get there. Oh, that knight got pummeled. Jeez. All right, let's get the defense for him. And you guys... I guess I need... If I'm going to go for the strategy of double attacking, then I really need to get over to Brasilia with some knights as well. Oops. Nope, don't want to do that. Oh, there's a bombard here. All right, we'll take a bombard over this way. I'm not actually sure it's going to get there in time, but we'll try it. I'll need it eventually for Cairo. Uh, I'm not sure there's enough spaces for me to actually get all these units queued up properly, but whatever. Try, I'm just trying to queue up as much as I can in advance so I don't have to like keep giving orders every single turn. All right, fortify. And you guys keep on sailing. Oh, what? This is still the same turn? Good lord. All right. All right, good old Toronto targeting Brazil. Oh, shit. This bombard. It's just getting wrecked. All right, luckily I got a promotion, which is cool. Oh, yeah, seven combat strength on defending. Yes, please. And then I don't know if this knight actually exercises zone of control or anything, but we'll try that uh, and see. He might, it might not actually do zone of control because it's not an actual, you know, marine unit. Uh, okay, so is it already time to do my industrial zone logistics? I guess it is. All right, there's the great engineer, Nicola. What does he do again? Uh, oh yes, provide two production. Um, and then regional districts reach three tiles further. So what's what's my most central factory? I I wish I knew. I don't know. It this this one looks pretty central. Let's go over there. All right, did that. Who's the next great person? This uh, city provides one appeal to. Oh fuck! This is worthless garbage. Shit. And modern and atomic that doesn't do any good. Instantly creates an infantry unit. This is actually the most useful thing I have. Because at least I can just pop him for an infantry unit with one promotion level. I don't want the diplomatic visibility. I mean, I guess I could finish this and just see what the next one is. Maybe that's the best way to do it. Okay, sure. We'll go back to the commercial hub investments. Let's repair the monument. Bombard. Yeah, this general is really helpful because it's giving extra movement points to my bombards. All right, so you're going to be shooting at Rio de Janeiro shortly, so we'll skip the turn for now. Using the extra movement point from Joan of Arc, she can get into that bombard can get into position as well. Um, what do I want to do with the knight? Should I just kill a slinger? Fine. Joan does not help the knights, by the way. She is only here to help my bombards. So the knights are kind of on their own. Field cannon. Healed up, is ready to go. Um, goodness, I feel like this is such a choke point, it's just hard to get in here. But maybe I can like sneak in through the back. We'll, we'll try sending him that way. Trade routes. Man, this trade route, I don't know why they started uh, needing to be reselected always, but it sure is annoying as hell. Let's fortify him until he's healed. And you guys can swim to the shore. I've already moved. Oh yeah, I've already moved. That was like the first thing I did. Can I actually attack? I can. I don't. I don't think I can actually attack. So I have to hold my breath and see what happens over there. If the bombard can't make it, then it's definitely not going to work out. 
he's wants luxuries for some gold. How about three gold per turn? Come on, buddy. Well, uh, fine, sure. We'll do that, I guess. Keep him, keep him friendly, you know, because he's so friendly right now. Why is he sending a great artist out to war? Okay, well, we learned something. Zone of control does not happen, and I'm pretty sure I'm fucked because... Yeah, this is just not good. Maybe if I sail, like, orthogonally, I maximize my odds of not getting hit. And we're going to put a knight, like, there or something to try to intercept it. They are hell-bent on killing that bombard, though. And I don't think three knights can, uh... Yeah, three knights definitely cannot take out that city. There's just there's just no way, because his, his mom looks are the unique version of the knight. They're just better. So let's uh, do the commercial stuff. Commercial hub investments, just to see what the next great person is. Hopefully it's someone who isn't a total pair of ass. I know there's a function to pass on a on a great person, but even when you pass, like it's still good to have built up as many points as possible. I have Kyoto, I can make a Hansa here. That's hysterical. All right, let's repair the synagogue. All right, you guys made it. You can actually embark. I just don't think that bombard is going to make it. Okay. So let's... What the? Whoa! Holy shit! That is crazy! Um, I have never seen bombards do this little damage to a wall. I guess it's because it just has so much strength. This, this is going to be hard. Jesus Christ. Um, that's going to take like many, many turns of... Uh, Attacks. Fuck me. Alright, well, let's kill this great person, which for some reason was just, like, sitting there. This is actually really important for my knights now to stop, um, the city from healing. So I need to get a knight to that space. That should actually do it. I can't at the moment. Um, uh, actually, I think that, I think this works. Yeah, this actually works. I think this also works to put it under siege. I'll pair up. Joan with that. I'm gonna just throw a knight in here Just to you know give the city more targets. I don't want to create a relic here So I think we're gonna just gonna pass on that man. Okay. Wow. That was that was a lesson. I have never seen um, The AI build like so many walls and have so many defenses that it actually um, that it, that, that it actually takes like multiple rounds of bombardment from multiple bombards to uh, destroy. So I might actually have to send some reinforcements here because, um, yeah, this is going to take a long time and I'm going to take a pummeling for as long as I am here. Yeah, my bombard is getting pretty badly hurt. He should get a promotion, hopefully. Oh, hey, the knight actually saved my bombard. That's awesome. All right, you know what? Hang on a sec. Let's, uh, I already upgraded everything, so let's go ahead and get the one that is, um, that reduces the combat strength penalty from being injured. That seems solid. And I don't know what, uh, is there anything else useful here? Blah, 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 I can get more gold. I don't need more gold. We're doing fine on gold. I could actually probably have switched out the gold gaining policies. All right, we're going to make a run for it with this bombard now. Well, now that the Bombard got one turn of Reprieve, let's go ahead and sail away with the Knight as well. There's no reason to keep the Knight there. Keep doing these Commercial Hub investments. Do, 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 do. Oops, got to pick the right one. All right, there she is. So I'm going to pass on her because this is just so useless. I might as well just save my Great Person points. And who's the next one? Uh, um, was that the, la like the last one? No, there's, there's still the Atomic Era. Okay, I guess it's not showing me who the next one is, but I'll see it next turn, hopefully. That's a little scary. All right, just in case, let's go ahead and get some industrial zone logistics here. Oh, man, these trade routes having to be reset is actually more annoying than I would have thought. All right, so Joan of Arc can just sit tight. Um, this bombard, I can form a core. What does that... Is that because they're next to each other? I actually don't know how... I've never, like, gone far enough in the game to actually, like, care about core. I believe it's when you have two units of the same type next to each other, but I think that's actually probably not even worth it because... 
I might as well just keep on. You, the, th the thing I'm concerned about is that if it if it dies, basically, like if another shot from the city actually kills it, that would be really really bad. But two of these individually do more damage than like if they were to be combined. On the other hand, maybe not because they're they're each doing less damage. So maybe like having one that was close to 77 would actually like be better than having two that are farther apart. I'm not sure. Anyway, we'll just keep shooting the city. Um, he has a promotion available, so as long as he doesn't die, he should be okay. Alright, this knight might as well kill the warrior. And this knight might as well... Oh, take a promotion. Yes. I could pillage the road. I don't know if that heals me or not from pillaging a road. Let's take a promotion. And, um, well, I don't know if I'm going to be... I'm going to need this combat strength against the fortified defender because this city has such crazy high defenses that I need every bit of help I can get. In fact, these commandos, I might just need them to, like, go and help with Rio de Janeiro. I don't know. Cairo's strength is only 55, so it's not insane like Rio's is. Yeah, let's just play this safe. I wasn't expecting this much resistance. Um, so I have to be kind of careful. Luckily, Rio just... I guess Brazil just has warriors still, which is a little bit embarrassing. Um, okay, the field cannon might not be bad to have an extra person shooting at these walls. So we're going to send a field cannon like right into this little pocket there. And then the knight. Yeah, I need all the help I can get over here, so we're going to send a knight, just in case one of my other knights dies. And then you... Now you keep going, you keep doing what you were doing. Alright, I can actually form a core out of the knights as well. Is it worth stepping away to kill a warrior? No, I'm just going to fortify. So that I take less damage from attacks. Oh! Uh, cool. Alright, so he's at war with me. Oh, God. Alright, so... Ahem. <coughs> This is, <coughs> excuse me, a little bit awkward. So we got an army of Mamluks coming in here. How is this thing still not fortified? Well, let's, let's go ahead and upgrade him. Um, let's take a shot, because it's free. Um, we're going to obviously need to get some units in here. I have tons of gold, so we're going to purchase field cannons. Can I purchase another field cannon? Oh, yes. Perfect. There's a bombard just hanging out. Okay, we're going to need to bring you back. Yeah. Okay, let's get, get, can I make, move one more step? Nope. Okay. That's pretty far away from everything. Um, let's go ahead and get the Great Lighthouse. I can only be built on the crabs. Okay, that's not actually worth it then. Venetian Arsenal can be built anywhere. Two good engineer points per turn and then some naval stuff. No, that's not even worth my time. Uh, let's make another trader, because I guess my traders got plundered or something. And here, let's actually produce another field cannon. Envoys being sent. Toronto still safe. Buenos Aires. Yep, Japan caught up to me. So those two free envoys I got from that merchant were very, very handy. All right, let's go ahead and kill one of Cairo's units, your religious units, since... Um, I'm at war with them all of a sudden. And this bombard is going to make it, though he's not really that useful. Maybe once I finish getting artillery, if I can sneak this bombard into uh, a city that I've captured, I can upgrade it to artillery. Because maybe if these were artillery, then I would actually have an easier time killing stuff. That's, like, potentially the problem that I'm having. All right, let's go, go, go. All right, so Joan is fine where she is, so we're going to skip her turn. This Bombard needs to claim its promotion and get a bonus when defending, obviously. This one, keep chipping away at the city, please. All right, it's not worth it to attack this, is this? This is, I mean, that's just a freaking disaster. All right, so, I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll kill that and a great artist. And then I can pillage, let's pillage, see what I get. Science. All right, that wasn't particularly worth it, so I guess, oh, that's cool, I can actually still take a promotion. Actually, how many movement points I have left? Yeah, no, I don't want to move, because then the city would actually heal if I moved. So yeah, we're going to take a promotion here, and just take the defense against ranged attacks, in case that's that, that does work against cities. Okay, this is, I don't know how long it's going to take me to do this, but I'm going to keep going until I take over Rio de Janeiro. It's been it's been a pretty long video already, but let's just get this done. Um, oh, hey, I can, I can actually pull these field cannons back before they get to Rio de Janeiro. 
That seems like a smart thing to do. I have to be really careful. Oh man, that scout is not long for this world. One of the problems with having quick movement and quick animation stuff on is, of course, the fact that, um, you know, you don't as easily get to see what all is happening. I'm gonna hide my bombard. Ooh, I can shoot from this encampment. That was very poor positioning by the AI. Which I don't really I don't really hold it against the programmers of the AI is, is you know terrible at the stuff because there's just it's just so difficult. Alright, unfortunately I can't move and shoot there, but I can move and shoot here. And I don't wanna Yeah, I think I'm fine. Let's just keep going with the commercial hub. Oh yeah, do I get to see the next great person yet? Uh oh. Uh, oh my goodness. There really isn't one after the modern era, right? Isn't there an atomic era in this game? Goodness gracious. Well, um, the money is still nice. Let's get some industrial zone stuff too. The the all of these they they make. Oh wait, wasn't I didn't they say that the yeah the, the great general is useful because I get a free infantry unit out of it. So we'll we'll use we'll do that. Yeah, let's do some encampment training as well. And then the scout. Oh my goodness, this scout is just. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna hide in the water. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> See if that works. Okay, the bombard makes it safe and sound. The bombard's guardian angel should make it safe and sound as well. And these guys, I think I'm just gonna send them in to help out with the fight. I mean, th th they got there in the least efficient way possible. But now that I'm here, I realize that like the most useful thing is helping out with Rio de Janeiro. Uh, can I actually take over another great person? Yep. Let's um. I can't pillage the road, so let's fortify until healed. Joan of Arc, you're good where you are. All right, Bombard is healthy at the moment. So I could take a promotion and do maybe more damage against the city. What's this thing's current promotion level? It's, I think, only at a promotion level of zero. So it's either getting the bonus against units or the bonus against when defending. It's not actually getting any bonus damage. So I'm going to wait until it gets damaged more and then use the promotion to heal. Okay, what's happening? Why, why, why am I not able to shoot the city? Okay, I am. It was just hard to click. Alrighty. God, this is taking forever. Um, let's kill this acolyte. Oh, that was dumb. It's good. the city's gonna heal. For no, the city is gonna heal. I think this spot isn't covered by zone of control. So yeah, that was a bit of a foolish move. So let's uh, finish off this Mamluk. Now I got a problem over here because my ally Toronto is getting attacked by these Mamluks. I think I think with the catapult behind and walls, it should be okay though. Okay, uh, let's keep moving these forward. My knight actually got hurt pretty bad. Ah, uh, boy, this is a bit foolhardy to just rush him in here. Mmm, no. Let's take a step back, fortify, bring this knight in. Oh, this knight can actually keep moving? Okay. Don't know why it's only showing me one movement point at a time, but whatever. And then that field cannon, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send these in to attack the Brasilia city here and, and try to forge a path into Cairo. Bombardino, let's heal up. Reset the trade route. And there's a scout up here who's getting shot at. So, um, go hide in the water. Field cannons. How many field cannons does a man need? I'm going to send just like one up here to tussle with the Mamluks, I suppose. And this knight, we're just going to send him in to kind of replace any knights that might fall. Oh, that's, that's, Japan is a battering ram stopping me from putting one of my units there because I'm not at war with Japan. That's hysterical. Yep, and the city healed because I stupidly moved my knight away. That was very foolish. All right, so let's do this. If I pillage a road, do I heal? Um, I don't know. Let's kill Albert Einstein. And let's keep shooting. Please, just... Just take. Thank you. Man, even after we get through all these defenses, it's, like, <laughs> gonna take forever to actually shoot that city down. Alright. Saladin just loves to fight me with his apostles, which is a very smart strategy. Oh, these mount- these mount- I can't get through here. This is, like, a little nook of mountains. Let's ride in that way, I suppose. Joan, I'm just gonna put you to sleep so I don't have to keep telling you to do nothing every turn. There's another 
knight showing up to fight a catapult. Let's take it out. And finally, my field cannons are getting in. All right. We have arrived. <laughs> oh, God. This is just a shit show, everybody. I don't deny it. I'm going to send a field cannon over here to help out. Yeah, I didn't I already send one in? I forget which one it was that I sent in. Maybe I should send one over here to help out with the against the Mamluks. And, uh, sure, we'll just step into the forest for the time being. You know what, let's, let's, should I form a core? Where's my field cannon army? Which, which one, are, which one is the army? I, I can't find it. How do I know which one is the army? I guess I click on them until I find the one that's, like, more than 50. Where the hell is it? I have no idea. Oh, God. Was it lost in the sands of time? Hmm, no idea. Maybe it's one of these. Oh, it's this one, isn't it? No, nope. it's only got promotion two. Where's the one that has promotion four? I hope it didn't die. Ah, field cannon army. There we go. Okay, that one I should I should have fighting against the city. I shouldn't have that one fighting against random Mamluks, which I should be okay against anyhow. Okie doke, five and five. Yep, yep, good times. And then you, I don't know, go there. Go there. Shoot at the city. That is the craziest capital I have ever seen in my time playing Civilization VI. Alright, so my field cannon's getting attacked here. Hopefully they can withstand the heat. We'll see. I know I can... By the way, I'm aware that I can levy the military here. I just, uh... I don't think it's actually gonna make things that much easier. Alright, promotion for him. That thing goes down. Take a step back. Oh, I can't shoot because it's a forest. Oh, crud. Can't shoot because it's a forest. Can't see when I take a step back. Okay. Let's take a look at great people. No! Nope. Okay, so clearly passing does not work the way I thought it did. Um, because unless there's a bug or something, um, I thought, you know, when you pass, you get to see what the next one is. But there's no other great merchant here, so I should have just I should have just recruited the stupid woman. I would have gotten the frickin' whatever and then seen what the next one is. So plus one appeal to any tiles it owns, that's completely worthless. Um so let's just get rid of it. And see who the next one is. Robert Gossard. Goddard, oh, Mary Catherine's husband. Is he less useful? Uh no, he's completely useless. All right, this is just for the science stuff. Okay, let's get the great general then. And at this point, I guess I'm only just going to be making the encampment trainings because clearly all of the, uh, I think, I think my commercial one is bugged out and my, um, industrial one is useless. La dee da dee dingle. I am so mad about Rio de Janeiro. <laughs> so ridiculous how much defense that city has. Can we get on shore? Can we please get on shore? Okay, thanks. Alright, there's a knight. And I gotta fortify here. And you can stop for now. Bombard. Alright. Keep tickling away at these defenses. Alright, starting to get through. Field cannon, can you take a shot at the city as well? Although if the bombards are doing this little damage, I imagine that field cannons going to be really underwhelming. Yeah, very underwhelming indeed. You need to get out of range from the city center. So let's put you there. Uh, let's fortify. Can you actually, can this field, is this field cannon ready to go? No, not yet. All right, so this knight, I guess we'll, we'll move him over. Um, so that maybe the city will shoot at him instead of the field cannon. Okay. Trade routes, Jesus Christ. Okay. And I guess I'll send him to the most forward city I have. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to wait until I get Rio de Janeiro. And then I'm going to send him to Rio de Janeiro. And from there, I am going to um, turn him into a free infantry unit. That's the plan. All right. Knight, you can make a little bit more progress. Knight, 
get, oh, fucking Japan. Ah, Jesus Christ. Okay, so get over there. Uh-oh, he's gonna get shot by two cities now. Whoops. Bombard. I didn't even know I had this thing. Um, I guess we'll send it over there. I don't know if it's gonna make it there in time, but we'll see. We'll send the field cannon over there as well. It'll be a race to see who can who can make it faster. Okay, come on, guys. Just get going. So many units. Oh, dear. All right, so a bunch of stuff happens. Hopefully nothing dies. Choose research. Okay, so now I can make artillery. The best steel. I think I can turn my knights into tanks, so I guess this is the most useful thing I have. And I have oil because I, I, I got that dude. Oh, wow, that requires a lot of stuff. Um, Whatever. Sure, we'll, we'll just do that. I, I don't know if it's the fastest way, but that way that's just like one less thing to worry about. And this bombard needs to rest. It's had a very long and very trying journey across the ocean, so it, it, it deserves a break. You know, let's just form a core. Let's try this thing out. Let's give it a shot. Let's see what happens. Boop. Oh, it even jumps across the river over here. So now this knight is a strength of 58 instead of like 48. So yeah, individually, like, two knights have more strength combined, but uh, having more strength on a single lump is, is often important when, when you're fighting something that's very strong itself. Oh, good lord. All right. So, um, field cannon now. Um, it's getting, it's getting, sh it's going to get shot from this other city. So this knight, maybe I can move it across the river and move the field cannon right up to it so it's not getting shot. Yeah, it doesn't really do very much, but it's something. Should I form a, you know, let's form a core. Fuck it. Let's just do this. That, that's just like, you know, just so that there's like less units that I have to give orders to. Just for no other reason than that. Alright. Stepping in. Um, I don't think that guy needs to step in, so let's just start shooting at the city. Jesus Christ. That was like nothing. Alright, we're gonna form a core here. I wanna make sure I don't form it out of my army. Let's form it out of this guy. Oh, this time they went in the other direction. Yeah. I swear, last last time I played, Field Cannon's damage against uh, cities was totally respectable, but Brazil, I guess, just really likes to fortify the shit out of its shit. Alright, you are just... I'm just going to put you to sleep until I can take over Rio de Janeiro. And you... Okay. This is going to take a long ass time at least that dude shoots twice per turn but this bombard i had back here definitely like does need to get its ass over um and start shooting at the city because as, as pathetic as the bombard's damage is the field cannons are even more pathetic all right so uh, a whole bunch of stuff happened um suzerain status whoa 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 suzerain status lost are you goddamn kidding me Oh, shit. No, uh, no, Germany's still good. Toronto? How did this happen? Oh, my God, that's terrible. So now Toronto's shooting at me? Oh, for fuck's sake. Crap. I did not see that coming. I was, like, leading 7-2. to two. Um, Terrible. Just terrible. All right, let's, I guess it's time to reset the encampment training I don't really care about neighborhoods it's not important let's just keep making money and not having to think about my stuff I'm gonna put the scout to sleep it's pretty worthless at this stage all right well wow, I don't know why wait wait didn't they kill Albert Einstein already do, do these things not die do they just like sit around or something and like escape Oh, he actually escapes into the city. Interesting. I did not know that. I thought you could kill those great people. Okay, field cannon. Get her done. Get. Er. Done. Alright. Bombards. Doing some stuff. Okay, can I maybe make a dent here? No, that's just catastrophically bad. Um, fuck it. We're forming a core. Alright, I think the city's still under siege. Field Cannon Core. Alright, it'll be ready to shoot next turn. Regular old Field Cannon. 
Okay, this is the guy that shoots twice. And it's an army. Man, even the army is doing piss-ass damage. Uh, I don't actually have this thing sieged right now. I should. Oh, God, that's actually a little bit tricky because this square is very difficult to get because of this river hooking in. Something needs to be on this square. I need two other units outside of it. Crud. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to send the knight to the back. This knight, I think I can still keep healing. But um, I need to get a third a unit in there. Okay, let's move one step. Promote. Bombard. Oh, yes, let's get artillery here. Hopefully that will help against these ridiculously uh, fortified cities. So we'll send the artillery like over this way. And it's artillery attack range, still just two. Still pretty weak. All right, field cannon, get over. Just just go. Just go so I don't have to think about you. Oh, what still needs units? All right. Please just pa end the turn. <laughs> Yes, Japan, we've been through this. Remember that time when you attacked me and then I, uh, you know, wiped the floor with you? Did I just lose Buenos Aires? Did I just did I just lose it? Japan just took over it. Where, where are my influence points? Where, why aren't I getting them? Oh, good lord. I don't know. So, anyway, let's get our thing. Um, district in this tile gains. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ugh, worthless. Doesn't even do anything. Okay, let me just check the next great person to see if this one is worthless too. Grants one to a military land unit. That's good. Yeah, we'll do that. So, encampment training. Field cannon. Come on over here. It's a field cannon party. Bombard. Bombard. Okay, I basically have to totally just bottom out this city. And then after I do, the knights are gonna get hurt real bad. I think one of my field cannons actually died out here. Okay, so this is a decisive victory. Is it, though? It is. Okay. Good. So, let's see if I can peace out with Brazil. Ah, he won't make peace. Can I give you some gold? Okay, a hundred gold is, it makes the difference. Okay. Wow. Well, then. Yeah, so I got two of the three capitals. We're done here, everybody. Thanks for watching. Sorry that was so long. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like and or subscribe. And I'll see you again soon where we take out Cairo. Take care.